fourth halo we're doing and um, so we'll continue doing a design around around her face okay so this is nice and dry now the um, the watercolor background that we have so just to make it easier for you to work from the center out for this halo um, I'm gonna do just like a little drawing of another circle to radiate out. And it's easier to do the design. Okay. You can see that. So this is using the uh, Polychromo Faber Castell white colored pencil. Um, I think I think I'll fill it in with some acrylic ink. I think it'll be easier to um, easier to do the design because that white color pencil is quite faint. Okay, just gonna blast it with some heat. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is um, do like a circular design with a cross on it. And so I'll, I'll work on opposite sides just so I can have it equidistant. So this is a Signo white gel pen. Um, they work fairly well, but sometimes um, they do clog. So you gotta um, just clean the tip, give it a bit of a shake. So that's the Signal White Gel Pen. You're pretty familiar with that. Okay, and I'm gonna make these little crosses in between with the Stabilo. I guess what I'm trying to do is just come up with different patterns. Um, a lot of people do mandalas, so this is not really officially a mandala, but so I'm just basically doing a circular design. But there's a whole there's a there is a whole movement for mandalas. Okay, so let's see. Ink. Um, I want to do some dots all the way around. So um, when you practice onto your sh your uh, your sheet or your acetate, um, you can use that as a reference to um, to go ahead and uh, put it directly onto your your art journal spread. That's why it's nice to have a bit of practice um, so that you know what what design you're doing.